Hey everyone, Server here, and today we will be playing more Thomas Was Alone. Let's go. And now we are back with our new friend. James had always James. been different. And not different in that kooky, OMG, you've totally got to meet my mate James, he's literally insane, kind of way. Ah, shoot. So I played this the other day and accident not even accidentally, for some reason my it was really strange. My audio did not sync up and it was just very weird. So I now have to replay it and I'm doing really bad. The other day I was doing awesome. But now it's all gone downhill. It's not pretty sight. Oops. Uh, well, I made it. Okay, spike scope. Whoops. Almost there. Oh, and dogs are barking. Awesome. Hopefully, you guys don't hear. Good. I did. did. He'd not seen anyone else in a long time. Not since getting eaten by that cloudy, pixely thing. He turned up here in some kind of cage. I want to do this in one go. Let's see if I can do this one. Oh yeah. He'd gotten out. But it had taken a long time. The whole point of this jump is I want to jump up and yeah, like that. Pretty much. Can I do it? I did it in one go. Woo! Party. I want to do a James like really any dudes? no one to awesome. insult him or question his unique disregard Sorry. pretty much he likes being alone because nobody can be like why are you not going down why do you only go up he likes being alone the little red guy looked confused his cage was a lot smaller than james's had been james decided to find a way to help Maybe they'd be friends. Wow. <laughs> I like the tee hee at the end. But I am oh I am owning right now. I usually do awful on that. Oh, hold on. Thomas has to go in his little box. Now they're together, yay. Thomas had no idea why he was here. One minute he was with his friends, the next he was being freed from a cage by a green guy with a nervous laugh. <laughs> He knew he had to get back to them. Turn him out. I really like whoever narrates this. It still keeps it in its His tone and everything. His hero seemed uncomfortable. Thomas imagined he'd feel the same way if he fell upwards all the time. <laughs> if he didn't know better, he'd have thought James didn't want to meet everyone. Hmm. Because Thomas is always about, like, um... Or not always about, but like all about like friends. We should all get together and type of things. Where I think I'm more like Thomas. Like I'm good with one friend. Thanks. Don't want to talk to anyone else. <laughs> I like pretty much all those boxes except for um, Laura. I think her name. Yeah, I think it's Laura. Okay, let's go. One shot, come on. I'm struggling at this jump right here. Okay. The things that I didn't struggle with before, I'm now struggling it with now. It's kind of funny. Go. Oh. oh no. No, why? Keep. No. <laughs> that was bad. Okay. Thomas, your turn. Show him how it's done. Or not. You know. Good job, though. Nice. Thomas wondered why the cloud thing had brought Ooh, them both here. Oh, look at that. Oh, so much skill. So much skill. So good. Actually, I stink. But, you know, whatever. Bounce up. Need some of your help. Let's just do this. <laughs> All the way up. Too far. Too far, man. Too far. Okay. Down. 
down. Okay, in there. Good job. Teamwork, buddies. Teamwork. Oh, shoot. I think uh, he needs help right there, doesn't he? No, he can just go up and move. Wow. That was complete luck that he had to go there. Okay, let's go. James grudgingly helped Thomas to each portal. He knew that eventually they'd find oh, the others. Oops. Nope. Then he'd go back to being the weird one again. I need some help up there. He Wait, uh, are they stuck? The time they had left. Oh, that's why that they have that. Okay, I got it now. That's why they have that, right? Yeah, okay. So in case Thomas messes everything up. Okay, so he needs help again right here. Oh no, okay. I don't think I need help there. There, yeah, I, I didn't need help there. Okay, down. Down you go. Oh, we're gonna need help there. We're actually up there. Oh, nope, we gotta go there. And then you go there. And then you go down. And down. There we go. And in there. Nice. I like how I just say that, that, there. This is the best commentary ever. You know, me just saying up, down, right. Why did Ooh. Thomas even want to spend time with James? Was he not repulsed by his weird color? Green's not that bad, bro. It's okay, don't worry about it. Whee! Okay. Go, 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 Thomas. Go, go, Thomas Ranger. Did he not care about his inversions? <laughs> no, you're you're perfect the way you are. Everyone's perfect the way they are. They shouldn't change for nobody's ears. Ooh. Ah. <laughs> okay. Just take my time. Take my time. Take take my time. Oof. Ah. Go. Oh. Okay, this is a fun one. I like this one. Okay. Greeny. Down. Down. Greeny. Best name ever. <gasps> no, why? Oh, shoot. Ignore. Ignore. I'm recording and you call me. That's not cool, bro. Down more. Move. Move. You can do it. No. Oh, my lord. I'm just panicking right now. James. Oh, I made it. Was having fun. Thank you. For the time being. Oh my god, that was close. Whew, that one was hard. Did not enjoy that one. Awareness is a word that gets thrown a lot, around a lot, and a lot of people consider if Thomas had been who have been created aware. Looking at the logs, it seems that the awareness was only ha happened somewhere around the na network. Blah blah blah. Tara okay. leaned her wizened head back. Tara, and Sarah. <laughs> why does that sound like Tara to me? I don't know why. The quadrilaterals were apparently after some friends of theirs. How petty an adventure! Oops. Sarah's probably my favorite. Just because she's amazing at jumping. There we go. And she jumped down. She spoke so cool. terms she could only hope they might understand of the fountain of wisdom, channel through which all data flowed. She is very full of herself, though. That's one thing. I really don't like people who are super full of themselves. 
if that makes sense. Like, John was cool about it and stuff, where she's just like, I'm awesome, get used to it. Ah, yes, I got it. And there we go. Sarah could leap in the very air itself. She was like an eagle or a flea. I don't get the voice he does for more, her voice. More like an eagle. She had vowed long ago that she would know this world. She would know what this world was. Sorry, but... Sh okay, so I'll just the give you... The red one, oh. who spoke wisely oh. for a lesser, offered Sarah their help. So long as she then helped them save their friends. He said that he too had wondered at the secrets of this world and would quite like a go on the Wisdom Fountain. That was okay. Okay, so pretty much she's going to go to this Wisdom Fountain. Sarah marvelled at his foolishness, but accepted his help. Sarah wants to go in this fountain and she's going to show Thomas and the rest of the game. But now I have to get up here, like that. Which I think in a couple goes, we go in the fountain. Or whatever. Sarah wondered the possibilities of the outer world. She had heard legends of a third dimension. Perhaps she'd encounter one of those curves the blind square had spoken of. And... I'm breezing through this. Single jump each? These were truly weak creatures. They possess heart, though. Sarah might consider taking them with her. If they were up to it, which they were probably not. The thing that... What... Sarah... It's really hard to explain. Sarah's accent kind of, huh? like... It sounds like he's doing a Scottish accent when he does Sarah, and it's really weird. I don't, I don't know how I feel about it. It's pretty cool though. It's very angry sounding. <laughs> okay, Thomas, get in your spot so we can go. I mean, she's full of herself, but she can back herself up. So she has like a reason to be. Though I'm still not a fan about that. But she's an awesome jumper and I love that. So, yeah. They were close. Sarah sensed the presence of the fountain. Just one more portal to go. And then she would have the knowledge. And then escape. Dun dun dun. No, come on. Oh, Sarah, why? Why you do that to me, Sarah? Okay, now, boys boys we've been having a tough day with this little thing we've been doing so you, oh oh my lord I am flipping out cause this isn't good no it's not good it is not all good in the hood oh thank gosh okay Sarah you can do this you can do it and you did it good job and there's the fountain of knowledge, Thomas or whatever it was called. Beam. That list he'd been writing seemed pretty petty now. This, well, this was all knowledge, all of it, right in front of him. Yeah, it makes me think of people when I see sorry Sarah couldn't step into it too. He could tell she felt the same way. Sorry, Sarah. In the shouting, <laughs> and the screaming. She's very upset. But too bad. Peace. Huh? Thumbs out. And back in. Thomas was connected to the internet for 12 seconds, and he had seen everything. He'd seen the cat who couldn't spell, <laughs> he'd heard of the arrow through the knee. Probably like a hundred times. He felt there was probably a thing called cake, but that was a lie. It's always a lie. This is wise, wise things that he's, she's learning. He, no, I was right first time. So, 
You could probably go this way. In there. Sarah there over here. Thomas. Thomas. Right there. Thomas knew where they were. He knew what they had to do. He hoped the others would understand. They were just beyond the next portal. But that will be it for today. Ooh, the old gang's back. Fun. <laughs> Anyways, like and favorite if you enjoyed. Subscribe to become a meteor today, and I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Bye.